Hello, I'm not streaming tonight, but I am going to unbox this present from my sister and my brother-in-law. I think, I think it might be nerd related. It might be a book of some sort. It feels a little bit flexible and the size seems about right. Could it be a game book? Could it be a book about some nerdy subject? What else would I read about, right? So I'll, I'll spare the card for later because that's not relevant to most watchers. They don't want to read it. Yeah, I'll just do it. Birthday card, yeah. <laughs> All right. I got some puppies. Did somebody say cake? And inside, it says, happy birthday. Hope you had a very happy birthday. And it said love and the whole list of my sister and their family, all the kids and everything. But what is the game book? I, I'm so, <laughs> I don't know if it's a game book. I don't know why I'm saying that. What is it? It could be something really stupid. It could be something really awesome. It could be something in between. Let's find out. Maybe it's a book about some kind of recipes. Maybe it's a book about. I don't know, I keep thinking it's probably a game book. But I think my, my Amazon wish list got raided. In other words, people take gifts from there lately. But let's see what it is. Can you see it? It's a big one. Pretty big one. Pretty thick paperback, it looks like. Let's see what it is. I'm not looking. Oh, it is a game book. Well, I'm trying to get this tape off without tearing the book. The tape is directly on the book. There we go. It is Dracula, Curse of the Vampire. An ace game book by Jonathan Green. So this is, um, you know, you probably remember we recently, well, if you watch this channel much, you know that we played a, uh, a game book about Beowulf, and we did that for about two or three streams. I don't remember how many exactly. And this is, I think, the same author, but it's definitely the same. Um, yeah, it's the same. I think it's Jonathan Green did the other one too. But this is about Dracula, as you can see. And um, I don't know if you're uh, playing as Dracula or what. Probably. Yeah, you're, you're you're probably like Jonathan Harker or something. Curse of the Vampire. And uh, here's the back. Unfortunately, on my phone screen, it, it shows it in reverse, so I can't read this on the screen while I'll show it. In the Wolf Haunted Carpathian, I can just do this, I guess. We can look at the lovely cover while I read the back. In the Wolf Haunted Carpathian Mountains, a young solicitor, Jonathan Harker, travels to an isolated castle to assist a mysterious count with purchasing a number of properties in England. But what he witnesses there drives him to the edge of madness. Meanwhile, in Whitby, Harker's fiance Mina Murray, visits her dear friend Lucy Westenra. But during her stay, Lucy is attacked and becomes seriously ill. In London, Lucy's suitor and physician, Dr. John Seward, becomes preoccupied with the case of a certain Mr. Renfield, an inmate at his lunatic asylum who seeks to collect lies for his master, having not long returned from a trip to Transylvania. And so the pieces for the game are set for they are all pawns in a plan devised centuries ago by the Voivode vo 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 of Wallachia, Vlad Tepes, a cruel tyrant whom history remembers as the son of the devil, his bloodthirsty deeds having earned him another name, Dracula. And then it says, <clears throat> Dracula, Curse of the Vampire, is an interactive horror novel inspired by Bram Stoker's classic gothic killer in which you decide which route to take which perils to risk and which of the terrifying creatures you will meet along the way to fight play of jonathan harker mina murray and dr seward you, you play both as all three of them or even count dracula himself you can play as count dracula or those other people that's pretty crazy but be warned whether you succeed in your quest or suc succumb to the curse of the vampire will be down to the choices you make but do not tarry for the dead travel fast. Huh. And here's a little comment here. This is the Rolls Royce of game books. And more fun than is strictly legal. And this quote here says, 
I can think of no other game book which exceeds this in terms of delivering the theme, atmosphere, and a compelling story. As a complete package, this is in the top tier of interactive fiction. Well, la di da. That sounds pretty fancy. Maybe this will be played on stream soon. We'll see. Let's take a look a little bit at the art inside. If there's anything worth looking at. <laughs> we'll see. Not, so far, I'm not too impressed with the artwork. I'm just seeing like generic kind of um, paragraph separators like this one. Uh, but there's probably some good art in here, I'd imagine, somewhere. Here's a, here's a full page one. That's very Dracula-esque. You have the, the bat vampire thingy and the wolf. What else we got? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's uh, Gary Oldman himself. <laughs> That's what it looks like, anyway. <laughs> Who's this fellow? Well, this guy doesn't look too well. That again might be a generic paragraph separator. Right, let's, look, look, let's check out one or two more, perhaps. Some rats. That, yeah, I saw a generic paragraph separator, the kind of dead head, dead person again. Ooh. The captain of this ship is about to get it <laughs> or maybe not the captain what do you call the person who steers the ship i don't know these uh sisters the sister smiley there ryan now um yeah they look like they're about to face something horrific and are hoping the crucifix will save them Were there like nuns or sisters in um, Dracula? I don't remember that. Oh wow, these ones are creepy. This is actually a very, very creepy picture right here. These must be um, some of, uh, what do you call them? The daughters of Dracula. Whew, ferocious looking. Actually they look very um, almost zombie-like more than typical idea of a vampire. This could be very interesting to play. Now, Rob Bob has a couple of books we got for his birthday months ago. So we have to play those too still. <clears throat> this is the cover cover model. Same one. The cover girl. Cover boy, I guess. <laughs> All right. Maybe that'll be it for tonight. Sorry I could not stream tonight. It's just been very busy over here at the W household. And... Let's see, let's find one more nice picture. One more good picture. All right, here we go. This, look, this one looks very Nosferatu-esque. That's really cool. And that's all. Maybe we'll play this soon on this channel. This is Dracula, Curse of the Vampire by Jonathan Harker. No, Jonathan Green. Illustrated by Hawkcock. Hawk And that's all, folks. See you next time. Bye.